Welcome to Neuschopin Symphony Orchestra's Arabella project. My name is Michael Francis, I'm the chief conductor here, and it's my great pleasure to welcome Marlene Bistrom. Uh, please tell us a little bit about yourself. Yes, I am a Swedish soprano, um, lyric or lyric dramatic. Uh, that means I, I sing stuff like Strauss now, and which is wonderful to try out. It's my first Strauss role, I'm uh, singing here. So that's wonderful. Um, I live in Stockholm. I have three children and uh, I work a lot internationally, but also in Sweden, which is wonderful. Could you please tell us a little bit about the character of Arabella and what kind of drama and things are you looking to bring to this rather unique role? Mm, it's an opera that plays in Vienna. It's very Viennese. Arabella is um, a duchess. Uh, but the family is broke, they have no money, so the only hope for this family is to marry Arabella to the right man. So she has this pressure on her, and uh, so that's where the story begins. <laughs> father has uh, he's playing cards and has all the money has gone away from the family so they're they're um, terrified uh, and and that's where we start and and she meets Mandrika and it's a it's a great love story between them perhaps you could also expand a little bit upon Arabella's character and what kind of woman do you find her to be when I started looking at it it, it was incredibly light to me but i see more and more that it's not actually and i'm i'm still i'm still looking into this what kind of a woman she is because she has this very superficial sides to her uh, but also a very strong relationship with the family and a, a family girl and she wants to do the right thing and uh, when she sees mandrika is is love at first sight and and uh, a new world that opens opens up to her. Arabella is an opera that doesn't seem to be performed that often. It is one of Strauss's lesser known operas. And yet it seems to have so much beauty within it. Um, but what's exciting for you is, of course, you're singing this at the Metropolitan Opera in New York in April. So that must be a wonderful project for you to both present this opera to a wider audience, but also to sing this magical role. Mm. Yes, yeah, very exciting. I hope not too exciting. <laughs> but uh, it's, of course, fantastic that I get the chance to do most of my part here in Norshipping. Great. Thank you very much, Marnie Bistrom.